Put your paws up. Come on. Put your paws up. Up, up. Come on. Here you go. One, two, three. Oh, God. Okay. Hello, it is day nine of Vlogmas. It's about 3.30, almost four o'clock. We haven't really said anything today. Um, this morning my friend Sam came over and we picked uh, yarn combinations for a little trunk show we're planning on doing soon between our designs and my yarn. Holy blowout. We dyed some yarn, so that is soaking in its final bath for the day. I'm covering the microphone, sorry. Uh, Jake just went over to his friend's house to watch football. I don't care about football, so I didn't go. And we're about to go and mm, take Audrey on a little walk because he took, uh, Jake took Iron with him, so it's just me and Audrey right now. So I might treat her to a little walk, a little hangout times. I'm just catching up on some Grace Babbles Traveling uh, Vlogmas. And oh my god, this Gryffindor robe. I'm so jealous. Um, we did not even look at robes when we were at uh, Harry Potter Studios. But as soon as she put it on and said that James got it for her to die in, all I could think of was, can I get one for the wedding day? Like when you're supposed to wear a robe or a button up shirt while you're getting ready so you don't mess your hair up. Can I just adjust a Hogwarts cloak? to be that. So we're gonna go on a walk before I explode. Um, I guess these little, these little things that just pop up and make my heart so happy. Oh my god, I want one. I want so many. I don't know if this means I have to go back to London or try and order a robe from somewhere, but I want one. Could you, oh man, I'm like, we're gonna be getting ready all day. What better way to get ready than in a Hufflepuff robe? Come on! The lady in front of me left her cart in the middle of an empty spot. So no, I can't do that. That's not a job. I usually go to Trader Joe's to go grocery shopping. I just didn't feel like driving all the way over there. But now that I'm here, I really don't want to go in there and shop. There's so many people. Not like Trader Joe's is going to be any better. Oh, God. I'm just going to go in and get eggs and chips. So I do most of my grocery shopping at Trader Joe's because they have less variety, so I get way less choice paralysis, but they don't have the Connecticut Farmers brand of like Eggs and Milk, which is a company that works with, I want to say seven farms around the state of Connecticut for eggs and dairy and stuff, so I do like to support them because that is important. And we don't have a regular like farmer's market or co-op or anything, so... If there was a way I could just get all of my meats and all that from local farms, I totally would, but we haven't really found anything. Maybe when we find a more permanent housing solution. So I'm gonna... So all excited for like a nice restful grocery shopping trip. Why did I think that was gonna happen? I'm gonna go get some eggs and chips and salsa. Because Jake doesn't like the Trader Joe's brand, the weirdo. And continue my quiet lady night, as I'm calling it. I no longer want to call it lady night, I'm just going to grocery shop. You guys, it's so busy here. Why do I even bother grocery shopping? This is awful. I'm ordering online next time.
hot spot over here. I'm just gonna. That's fine. So it's, I wanna say like 8.30, it's not that early. No, late, it's not that late. So we have gone grocery shopping. We did not meal prep, but sort of organized everything in the fridge and got all of the um, chicken that we bought marinating so we can just throw it in the slow cooker tomorrow to make shredded taco chicken. So we can do tacos and soup for this week. Uh, Jake's gonna pick up the chorizo so we can do uh, kale chorizo sweet potato soup. We had that a couple years ago and it was so good. So I've just been craving it enough lately. He is still at his friend's house with Iron, so it's just Audrey and I who is licking the bed like a weirdo. And we are super tired because we stayed up so late last night looking at houses. So we are going to sit in bed and knit a little bit on our northeasterly blanket. So here we go. We got our light, light stripe and our dark stripe. We just started another light stripe down here. So we're just gonna work on that for a little bit and watch some Great British Bake Off Masterclass and dream of all of the Great British Baking I want to do this winter. I think I'm gonna take a week off around Christmas. I don't usually do that, but I think I will this year and just bake until our house explodes with baked goods. Because I love baking. So much. My hair is going crazy. So I'm going to sign off here. I haven't edited yesterday's vlogmas yet, so I'm going to edit both of those tomorrow morning. We do have a kind of early morning. We have to drive up to Central Connecticut to meet up with a friend to talk about hair stuff for the wedding. I know it's super early for that, but I would just like to get everything squared away as early as possible so we know exactly how much we need to save up for next year. So I'm trying to be very organized about this. I think it's working so far. We only have like two things booked, so those two things are very well organized. All right, I'm going to go watch some Great Bridge Bake Off and do some blanket knitting, and I will talk to you all tomorrow. Good night.